Hey guys, it's Aubrey. Thanks for watching again. Um, if it's your first time watching, hello, welcome. Thank you for watching. Um, this time I'm going to be doing a boxy charm unboxing again. I've done one prior, um, but I was kind of excited about what I got, so I ordered again. And just to kind of give you guys an idea of all they have to offer, I'm trying to open the box now with the box cutter. This is why I usually do it um, prior to the video. But yeah, um, I was really excited about this. I also did uh, Boxy Luke's, which is a huge box um, with jam packed with stuff. And it's an additional $28.99 plus tax. Um, Boxy Charm is $21 in tax and it's a monthly subscription box. So um, with these, I forget how many, how many products are in it, but I'll let you know when I open it. I believe it's like five or something like that. But Boxy Luke's was a huge box and you can watch my previous um, videos to see what that was all about. So let's dive right in. Oh, just in case you're wondering. Boxy Charm. Hello Charmer. And it tells you hashtag Boxy Charm for Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, and Instagram. So they give you coupons, usually for products um, that you got, like for the company that they come from, they'll give you like, you know, some type of discount. And there's little cards about that. There's a card that explains, on the other side of this, explains everything that's in it. And let's look what we got. Elemis Superfood Vital Veggie Mask, Nourishing Prebiotic Green Mask advanced skincare so i don't know if you guys know but prebiotics are really good for your body i've never put any as far as i know on my let me see if i can focus in the camera i don't know if you guys can see that um i've never put any on my um face but maybe it'll help just as good or in a similar way uh, apply the mask twice weekly on cleansed skin a slight tingling may occur while the mask works, works its magic. Oh my goodness. Remove after 10 minutes with a damp, dark cloth. Oh, probably because it might stain your washcloth. That's neat. I wonder if it smells. <laughs> Do you think it's going to smell like veggies? <laughs> I don't know. I'm kind of scared. Mmm. That smells good. Doesn't smell like veggies. It's got a little bit of a perfume or a scent to it. I'm not sure what that is, but let's see. It says, feed the skin with this versatile super green mask formulated with avocado and broccoli seed oils, rich in omega fatty acids to help support the skin's moisture barrier. Vitamin C and passion fruit acids help brighten for a fresh looking complexion. That's nice. I'm gonna try that tonight. My skin's kind of sensitive, so hopefully it doesn't irritate it. Ooh. Brushes. Luxie, or I think that's how they pronounce it. Uh, large eye blending, a precision crease brush, and a foundation brush. Ooh. I love brushes, especially after you've used yours for a while. It kind of gets wore out or whatnot. Uh, unleash your true beauty by being kind to the earth. Please help keep our planet beautiful by recycling this package. Will do. Alrighty. I'm going to let you take a look-see. Oh, that's pretty. I like the handles on these. They are very neat. I'm not a fan. If you could look at my previous boxes. Um, I did a fire and nice video. And the wooden spoon on there was so cringy. Like nothing against fire and nice. That box is actually a very good deal. Um, it's very cheap for the products you get. So I'll be ordering that again. But the wood was so. That's the only thing I would change about the boxes. The wood on the wooden spoon was so like. I guess you could say coarse. It was irritating me because I hate wooden spoons. But this wood, however, 
it is very smooth it must be treated or something but that is a nice brush that is super nice I don't know if you can see it oh yeah I can't wait to add this to my collection start using it especially for eyeshadow oh my goodness I don't have anything good for eyeshadow I usually use my finger and then there's this one I think that one's the crease brush yep and the large eye blending brush fun stuff and put that in there all right, let's go into this a little bit further. I'll wait to show that what what I see. But this one, ooh, yes! So usually I get like a bunch of like eyeliner, uh, but it's liquid eyeliner and I don't use liquid eyeliner. I never, I'm just not good at it, first off. Um, second, it takes too long. I don't know who has time for that. I don't. Ain't nobody got time for that. You know how they say that in the video. Anyways. <laughs> it is called Appeal Gel Liner in Forest Green. This is my color. I love. All right. Now I have black eyeliner on. Did it heck quick. I was in a hurry today. I had a dance appointment. But the green. I have green eyes. And so I'm stoked about getting a regular eyeliner. Oh, you don't understand. I think I have like five liquid eyeliners and I wish there was like an option they ask you if you like eyeliner and I'm like yes who doesn't like you're crazy if you don't but they don't give you an option if you want liquid or not I don't want liquid if anybody's watching that sells subscription boxes and I'm ordering from you please don't give me no more liquid I don't need it I've got no no use for that I'm gonna have to donate somebody it's not open it's sealed so I'm going to have to donate it because I do not like liquid. Okay, this plastic's being crazy. So I'm not going to take it all off, but I am going to do... Ooh. That's a decent green color. It is a forest green, like it says. It glides on very easily, too. It's not waterproof, which I love waterproof eyeliner, but... I'm gonna use this because I've been using black for way too long and although black is awesome, um, I like to switch it up. I like that more, um, I guess, exotic eye look. Usually when I do put eyeliner on, when I have the time to do my whole face, but I'm excited about that. Finally, I got some regular eyeliner. And then we got, what is this? I should probably look at the, on the um, paper here. It's a nude lip gloss. A long-lasting thickening formula that conditions the lips while delivering high shine and full pigmentation. Wear it alone or over our new lip liners. Gluten-free, talc-free, vegan, and always cruelty-free. I'm going to see on that eyeliner. Let's see real quick. Gel eyeliner. Yeah, I was, what? What? Okay, guys, let's take a step back. This eyeliner, maybe I should have read the card because this eyeliner, they say, now this is green, okay? Force green. It says right here, line and define your eyes or lips with your new appeal gel liner. Who in their right mind, let me tell you, who in their right mind would put this on their lips? I just want to put it on my lips just for fun. I'll do it at the end. Just to be funny. To kind of give you an idea of what the heck are these people thinking. I don't know. Love you, but no. <laughs> Is that the new trend or something? Like green lip liner. Ooh. So cute. Not. But I do like nude lip. Like gloss and stuff. So... Let's see if this is sticky, because I hate sticky. Forgive me for doing this out in mirrorly. I um I like the um 
I like the, the wand, the, if that's what you call it, the applicator. How it's like flat. That's what you need. A lot of different lip stuff has like, it's more circular than that. More like a colander or whatever you want to call it. Mm, this is nice. This is like so silky. Not really that sticky at all. <laughs> I felt crazy kissing the kissing the camera right now. But wow, mm, it's like buttery. Mm, that feels nice. This is the thing that I was so excited about. This is butter. This is butter. Let's look at this card because I've been failing at this. Let's see. Serving queendom realness. Bring out your inner goddess <laughs> in butter. London's vibrant natural goddess eyeshadow palette. Enchant with six highly pigmented, long-lasting shades. Whether you're feeling like a diva or a temptress. No, we're not a temptress. But a diva, hey. These cruelty-free shadows pair effortlessly to create imaginative looks that will make a powerful entrance. I love eyeshadows. Let's see. Oh, these are pretty. Pretty. Oh, this mirror. I hate it when they... Okay. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'm trying not to blind you. It's a mirror. Ooh, those are pretty. Maybe if I take that off, it'll be a little bit easier to kind of see it. Yeah, it's a little bit better. I like that. Ooh, the green. Is that green? Oh my gosh. Do you see that pigment? Oh, that is pretty. That for sure is going to be my new go-to. See what I'm doing? I have an eyeshadow brush. What am I doing? <laughs> I'm just so used to it. It's like easier to do quick right now without a mirror. That is pretty. That is super pretty. I'm going to try a different one on the other eye. Don't make fun of me. I'm just trying to show you guys what the difference is in color. Oh, that's cool. I wouldn't normally choose this color, but you guys get the idea, right? Wow. I'm looking like a diva with two different color eyes. <laughs> oh, I'm crazy. That's all right. So that's all the products. Um, I'm just gonna do what I said I was gonna do. Let's see. I don't know how good the um. That's gonna go on. With this lip stuff on it. So. Okay, this is for fun, guys. Because I'm crazy like. It. Oops. <laughs> Seriously. I can't do it. It's too hard without a mirror. But you guys get the point. Who in their right mind in this day and age would do this willingly? I don't know. I don't know. I wouldn't. Would you? Let me just think about this. This is like back in the day, like when you're in like me personally, I'm in my 30s. Back in the day when we were in like seventh grade or something, my sister was in high school. We would do this with our lips. It isn't in style anymore, and especially not with green. Who would do green? And now my husband's gonna come home and he's gonna see my different colored eyes and my green lined lips. And he's gonna think something is all right. Okay. I hope you guys liked the video. Me being silly and all. Stay away from green lip liner. And if you liked the video, like, subscribe, comment down below. If you have a subscription box preference, um, put it in the comments. If I, whichever one gets the most comments, I will 
I'll buy it and I will do a video on it. Thanks for watching again. You guys have a great day.